flurry of bullets, a flurry of bullets. Ooh, ooh. Okay, this was this was a bad idea. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome to episode eight. I think I got it right this time of our Jurassic World Primal Operations playthrough. There we go, I made it that time all the way through, woohoo! So, there has been a new update, or not an update per se, but the events have changed. Now, normally it's been T-Rex, but we've done with T-Rex, and now we are moving on to the Spinosaurus events. So, if we look at the achievements, um, they're all Spinosaurus keys, um, fully complete mission one for 30, uh, part two, complete it for... So, each time you complete a mission, we get basically to open up a crate it's close to it so if we just complete mission one of a difficulty of 600 Yay! but look at that render it's a draw it's so interesting because this picture that they've chosen to use for the spinosaurus doesn't exist they've actually made this so the head and the arms are legit they're from the animatronic but the rest of the body is actually completely rendered. Uh, like, they've had to recreate that. Because I think everyone who's seen Dress Bar 3 or has searched it on Google has seen that render. And it ends at, like, the elbow or, like, halfway through the body. So that... It's quite interesting to see, like, a legit Jurassic Park 3 Spinosaurus in a Jurassic game. Uh, ever since, what, 2003, 2001, was it? When Jurassic Park 3 came out and those games came out? We have not seen a render of you know, the Spinosaurus in a long time. So, wait, was that, did they say something about a Spinosaur? Oh, rescue the Spinosaur. Oh, we got the thumbnail for the video already. Oh, yeah. I am powerful. Yes. Do I even need to do anything? Oh my God. Oh, there's a sniper. Oh, he's dead. Oh, what is she? My bullets are so powerful. They aren't trank bullets. They're killer bullets. Oh, except for him. And, and, and you know what? Poss possibly the shield dude. The shield dude is the only one that maybe I'm not going to be able to kill. So we are going to need to yeah, just give him a couple of whacks. And boo-oofu. Ooh, we got to see what the Spinosaur looks like. I think it looked a bit derpy in its, uh, like, holographic form. Holo holographic hologram form, I should say. Oh, no, give me all of those coinage. Heck, yeah. So we basically complete this mission and we'll get to open one. Um, so I'm not too sure what's happened to all of my other T-Rex keys. Now, I did make sure to use them. And they're dead. Brilliant. Uh, before this clocked over. So last night when I was just grinding out levels, I made sure. Oh, God, it exploded. Don't you love it when that thing happens? Oh, I love a little explosion. So it, see, it says rescue a spiner. So I'm assuming that it's just going to be lying down and maybe we don't actually ever fight it. Uh, which is going to be interesting. Oh, and they're dead. And, uh, oh, there it is. Oh, she's sleeping. Oh, with her eyes wide open. Okay. <laughs> and it doesn't look any bigger than, like, a regular dinosaur. Like a regular T-Rex. Look, look at the Spinosaurus is absolutely ginormous. And this thing's just, just, I don't know. It's, it's tiny. What did it, it managed to hold one of the guy's leg in its mouth and, like, swing him around. That, uh, that yeah, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe it's because it's lying down, but it doesn't, it doesn't seem like it would be able to do that for me. So here we go, 25 keys just for completing it. And then our achievement will also give us another 30 keys. So, oh, this is going to be also, we're going to achievements. It should be revealed. Yeah, so 30 keys. Oh, oh, we do mission two. Oh, we have to do that 10 times though. So mission three uh, we get 25 keys, so we'll quickly do um, this mission. Now, this will probably cost 10. Yeah, now this one normally costs 10. Uh, we also will continue with the campaign. Um, interestingly enough, I'm on chapter 6 now, so we've only got two chapters left. But the last one that had Carnotaurus, uh, Proceratosaurus, and uh, Pachyrhinosaurus, unfortunately... Um, we, I was not able to unlock any of them. So for the past five chapters or so, four chapters, some of them have been repeats, with Trodon being one of them, uh, you've been able to unlock a dinosaur. But this is the first time in chapter five where we saw new dinosaurs to rescue and stuff, but we didn't get to change or like rescue them. We didn't collect their DNA. So 
I don't know whether that sets a thing for chapters here on out. So in chapter six, I'll not be able to do that as well because I think chapter six also has different dinosaurs. I might be wrong though, we'll find out. Oh no, a Sukumimus. Oh, so it must be all of them. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, have we seen a Sukumimus? But no, I do have a Sukumimus. All right, so we got loads of crates to open. You know me, I've waited. I've waited till we're recording the video and then we're gonna showcase everything. <laughs> what if it like Scooby-Doo there for a second? Yes, yes, I think I'm level 12. I might even be higher. I can't remember. I think the last episode I leveled myself up quite a bit. Oh, look at you. Now you're dead. Oh, what a shame. All right, we're gonna have to use the ankylosaur here. Oh, you know, we, we can just shoot it there. 98 damage on a crit. So this Brody, the character I'm playing as right now, seems to be the most OP character in the entire game because I heal 25% of the time. Or I think 25% of the time. I heal 11% health. I heal when I summon a dinosaur. So there you go. I just got 23 health right there for just summoning the, uh, the Dracovinator. So also what I realized is that your sanctuary level, your you know, your main level, is completely tied, what majority seems like, it's completely tied to you leveling up your dinosaurs. So if you want to unlock other dinosaurs quickly or, you know, get keys, because I think every time you level up, you um, you get keys as well, because you do an achievement for it. Or at least it's Stegosaur DNA, which we are pretty close to. Um, so, oh my god, that guy's tough! Or did I just not do anything to him? I might not have done anything to him. There you go, give me the coin. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll take the health. I could always, yeah, when I summon a Dracovinator, it, that's, oh, look, there's the Sukumimus. I don't think we've ever seen one that we can fight. And I'm assuming we can't fight this one either. And apparently I can't even summon the helicopter, even though it's there. And there we go. That's mission two done, which doesn't give us any keys guaranteed, but we might get one or two. It is mission one, right? So let's see. Did we get anything? Oh, we got one. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> so we got 25 for just completing mission one, as well as 30 for doing the achievement. So I'm assuming fingers. Oh, so we do have a claim rewards. So this event has expired. Don't forget to check in. Okay. So I can claim rewards still. Oh, interesting. So they're both on. So it does give you a chance if you miss something to get said reward. So we get 15 possible for completing it. And then we get 25 just for the achievement. So we'll probably open three. No, definitely two. Definitely two. I was going to say that's 90. That's 90. But we do have two Jurassic crates also to open. So we got a lot to go through. Here we are. What's it going to be? Oh, they're after eggs. <laughs> eggs. Oh, get in. Right, if only I could take the snowmobile. Ah, uh, if only, if only. So, what my strategy, and I haven't tried this just yet, but when we do the campaign and stuff, I'm I'm actually kind of tempted to try out doing a hard mission with this strategy, because it could work, it could work, as long as I survive. Now, mission one, I'm assuming, doesn't have too many people to kill, even on hard. I could be wrong. They might change it out. I'm, I was just assuming... The, you know, the lazy way they could they would do it is that it's the same people, but now they're just a lot tougher. Like, they haven't actually changed the loadouts or anything in the uh, the different difficulties of missions. I could be wrong, but I get the feeling that they, they won't have. Ah! Stop! Oh, no! I got a boom boom! You're gonna kill yourself if you do that, you fool! Well, he died anyway. So my, my tactic is to have loads of dinosaurs that don't take much um, action points. So if I do take a hit, I can survive. Like, I can just get loads of health back. I can just sit, you know, off screen and just constantly pump out level, like threes and stuff, which expires super quick, and I can just get loads of health. I think I'm wondering if it's, it's probably better just to, to have one dinosaur that isn't leveled up too much, because then, you know, it'll expire really quick. And I can keep on sending it in. Like Dracovinator. Dracovinator is level 10, I think. But it does expire super quick. Um, oh, there's lo and guys, let me know if there's this particular T. Oh, there's the eggs. Oh, ho, ho, as well as the giant ones over there. Good lord. They're massive. This is chaos. 
This is uh, Chaos Island. I love Chaos Island with the nests and stuff. I don't know what it was. There's something so satisfying about being in that little menu and looking at the eggs, and it was just, like, quiet. Like, the rest of the game had the soundtrack play, but when you went in the nest, it was just completely silent, and you were, like, listening to the clicks and stuff. I don't know. I'm weird like that. I just I just enjoyed it for whatever reason. So, 15. Okay, so that takes us to the 25 we got last time. Takes us to 40. 50, 60, 70. 80, 90. We should be on 95, I think. So, we should be able to open three Spinosaurus crates. I'm assuming. So let's go on here. That's another 25. I'll take that. Uh, we go on to shop now. Um, so we have... Yeah, so I've got 16 T-Rex, so it's not enough. I'm assuming, hopefully, that saves until the T-Rex event comes around again. So we've got three Spino Crates, two Jurassic Crates, and I'm saving up to open five Jurassic Crates. So let's try a, a Spino Crate. So we get Byronix, we could get Spino... Now, I did open eight or nine T-Rex crates and didn't get a single T-Rex. So I'm hoping maybe we'll do a little bit better this time. So you know what? Even when we just get common DNAs, it's not too bad because that's going towards ranking up a dinosaur. So we could get four Spino, three Baryonyx. Um, and then is there the Suko there? Yeah, the Suko there. The Ichthovenade is there. So a lot of dinosaurs. Ooh, here we go. Will we get a Spino? It doesn't really... Even if we do get a Spino, we're not unlocking it. Was that a yellow? No, it wasn't. So, more Clovenator. Oh, sorry. Spinosaurus. Uh, no, sorry. Uh, uh Succovirus. <laughs> you stupid, James. <laughs> Bad beaver. Right, let's go. Come on, please. I'd love it just to just see if I can get it, but... Uh, Ichthovenator, Trodon, and Crytonosaurus. I'll take that, because Trodon's actually getting quite close to being leveled up. So, let's do two of these. So, we could get Ankylosaur, Stiggy, and Pteranodon, which we're probably not going to. We did get Sino, though. I think Sino's been the only rare, or sorry, you know, purple that we've gotten before. Epic DNA, I should say. Okay. Right. Will we get something good here? Uh, no. All comments. Sweet, but you know what? That's not so bad. Covenator, Acrocanthosaurus, and the Ajakadabudabu, whatever it is. Um, all is good. I don't have a single dinosaur at rank 2. So, whatever we get here is brilliant. And a rare this time. Oh, okay. Uh, that's the Cynosaurus. Oh, three. You know, I'd prefer if we just got all Trodons. Because that would take us really close. Uh, so, let's go back. We'll look at quests. Yeah. It ends in an hour. Okay, I mean, it doesn't really make much of a difference. We're, we are going for Homalocephaly. So let's have a look at our dinosaurs. So we're 56 out of 70 for Trodon to level that up. So what I'm going to do is I think with our next Sanctuary level, we get 10. And that's all for Brody. This is all for leveling up Brody stuff. So I am tempted to level up. Because Trodon is something that we're going to get to level or rank 10 pretty damn close or soon. So if we get it to level 10, ready to be ranked up, at least that, it'll probably be one of our better dinosaurs. So the next one that I'm kind of tempted is Sungopterus. Even though it's not very good, maybe it'll be better when we level up. So we all... That's it, we're level 5. Sweet! That's what you gotta do. You wanna get next rank up? Just just, just do Sanctuary levels. Um, and then Draco Rex as well, being a very low level. So we'll get you up to level 10. Look at that, we're level 5. We got so much. Um, we've still got a bunch of dinosaurs to get to level, uh, 10, so I may as well. We may as well just rank all these up to level 10. We could have an entire team, um, of ankylosaurs. Uh, oh, actually, i tell you what I did want to do. I might switch this out for the, uh, Acrocanthosaurus. So what do we get at level 6? So level 6 is for, I can't remember her name. What's she called? Adriana. Adriana. So we get the rewards for Adri Adriana. Uh, so we pretty much got everything level 10 except for this guy. So we'll get you to level 10 as well. That takes us to level 6, which gives us even more. Wait, what? That's not what it said it was going to give me. What? <laughs> I just got Amber for that? What? You, oh, okay. That was weird. Uh, so quests. Here we go. So level up companion dinosaurs, 90 out of 60. So maybe we'll get another one. Uh, one extra key for leveling up a companion. Uh, leveling up again. Another extra key for 90. Um, so I don't know if we're any closer to getting another one. We've got two keys. We've got two keys. 
So keeping an eye on the achievements is actually a good idea. So collect all daily quest rewards is another Stegosaur. So I do want to check uh, how close are we to unlocking Stegosaurs? We're 23 out of 50, almost halfway there. Um, and then the, I think there's another one we're pretty close to. Homalocephaly, 24 out of 50. So I do want to check our handlers to see if we can upgrade this guy. So we do need 960. So we're getting close, but we could. 25% chance of healing even more health. So we'll put him up a little bit more. And we'll also damage taken by uh, the club tails, the headbutts, and the Sukumayamuses. So we'll upgrade this a fair bit. Oh, yeah. So now they take 8% less damage. So if we wanted to, we could really, you know, have our team rotate around our handler. So we need like a Sukumimus, we need a Draco Rex, and we need an Ankylosaur. That's basically what we need. And they'll all take less damage. But at the same time, yeah, they're not. Oh, and there we go. Upgrade equipment. Uh, for five, and upgrade equipment for seven. Oh, we can open up another freaking, what's it called? Um, a Jurassic crate. I didn't realize upgrading so much was, uh, I mean, we could even upgrade some of the other equipment, to be fair. Um, so maybe we'll do that. What are we going to get this time? Oh, one rare. And it is, yeah, Dracorex is okay. And I think this is a Chungasaurus. Chunga. Chunga bunga bunga. Right. Oh, I, I love this game. I, I don't know. I love I love the whole grinding aspect of it. It's it's satisfying, especially you just want to play something and just shoot something. It's loads of fun. Right. So, uh, I mean, what we could do is actually just keep up upgrading this. What? I, yeah. So that's all, as far as he can upgrade. Uh, we'll upgrade her a little bit as well, just to see if I've got any quests that are oh, getting close to being done. Unlock new dinosaur companions. So we still haven't gotten there. So, well, the only way to unlock dinosaurs is literally to just keep on doing the missions uh, in story mode. Or at least that seems to be the way. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do my tactic. Uh, we'll take our Dracovenator we'll keep in. We'll take our Acrocanthosaurus. We'll put in you and then we'll put in you. And I think all of these, yeah, they're only three each. So, yes, it's medium. But at the same time, I'm going to be able to heal loads. I don't need any character or any person I <laughs> could, could kill to drop any health kits. I could just regenerate myself. All right, let's go. Let's see if this tactic works. I'm apparently a lot weaker because I don't have the Ankylosaur. But I think I'll be okay, personally. Uh, oh, God. Oh, yeah, these guys are very weak. <laughs> but I don't know. It, it, it's, worth, it's worth a try. Because now I can just, like constantly do this and when i'm fully maxed up to like level 15 or whatever it is um when one of my creatures actually kills a dude uh, there's a chance i can get even more um what's it called uh action points back so i can regenerate health even quicker i'm just wondering if this oh come on get him somebody get him Where, where's that trying ah <laughs> so if i just do this and just stay here yes i can take hits but will I regenerate? Oh, yeah, there's 24. <laughs> yes, drop a rock on him. Right, I need I need you to poison him. Yep, yep, yep. There we go. Oh, it looked like, it looked like he just... What, he just ran into the wall and just exploded. Go on, drop a rock on him. 15 damage. Oh, and it also stunned him. Oh, you buggy. You yeah, buggy. Oh, you may hit me, but I'm going to kill you. <laughs> So we don't need something as big as an Acrocanthosaurus. We don't need an Ankylosaur. However, they do a lot of damage as well. So it really depends. Uh, yeah, it, it, it's okay. It's okay. Yes, I may, I may take a hit or two. But as long as I'm not playing on hard mode where something could just one-shot me, I think I'm all right. So the Draco Rex takes a little less damage from stuff. Oh, ha, ha. Ah, I'm not going for that. I can heal myself. Thank you very much. Let's go this way. Hey, Rollies. Nope, nothing. Okay, okay. Yep, there we go. Oh, what's it got now? A huge... Oh, God, the health. Oh, Jesus. I think the sniper got me there. Oh, God. Roll. <laughs> okay, okay. Maybe this isn't good. Maybe this isn't good. Yeah, high-power weapons are not good for this strategy, as you can quite clearly see. Yes, drop a rock on them. Woohoo! Perfect. Shoot him. Yes. More shots. Yes. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Really, 
if I wasn't recording, I'd probably easily be able to, um... Oh, well, I hit somebody else. Uh, just, like, hide off in a corner and get full health. But because I'm recording, I kind of... Oh, God. Oh, I got some health. Oh, do you want my, my perks? <laughs> yes, kill him. Beautiful. Go, my pretties. Right. Yeah, I mean, it's a little bit harder. The health regeneration's good. But I don't know if it makes too much of a difference. I don't know if it's worth the trade. I really don't think it's worth the trade off of having something that can just do a bunch of damage. As opposed to just healing more. I mean, these guys don't really do much. So, oh, you're going to try to shoot me? <gasps> he did! Go on, do it again. I dare you. Oh, you can run away like a coward. <laughs> it's like, I've got a big chest in me, but no! Ooh, two of my things. Thank you. Let's go. Let's go give it to him. Can I heal? I'd like to heal. No heals. Summon three of them. And no dice. All right. And they've all buggered off, I think. <laughs> or are they actually doing stuff? Whoop! Where are you? Where are you guys? Guys! Guys! I'm gonna run away! Run away! Ah! <laughs> oh god, I didn't heal. I didn't heal. Guys, this is... Whoop! Oh! Not good! Not good! Ah! This is really not good! I'm just slowly going backward. No, you don't! No, you don't! Yes! There we go. There we go. Yes, Sniper, you can't touch this. Still haven't healed. This is no good. Oh, God! Oh, no! He killed him! Oh, God. Flurry of bullets. A flurry of bullets. Oh, oh. Okay, this was this was a bad idea. <laughs> Very bad idea. But, you know, we all, we all do damage to them, I suppose. Yeah, there's more health. Yeah, the guy with the rocks now pose a really big issue. Yeah, we stunned him. More shots. Just some pot shots. Pot shots. No! <laughs> Stop! Oh! No! Yes, the help is coming! Oh, what's this guy doing? I have no idea. Oh, oh god, the lag. The lag. It's too many dinosaurs. Oh god, he, can't, he apparently hit me, but I don't think he did. Oh! Oh! I'd buy trees! Draco, somebody go get him! Please tell me this was the, the generator thing. Oh god. Oh god, I hope it was. Well, either way, there we go. I think we can shoot him now. Can I shoot him? Why can't I shoot him? Why is he not targeting him? Why is he invincible? You know what it is? I'm just gonna run away. <laughs> Look at that Sundopterus. The power that it has to hold that bleeding rock. Yep, that was it. I thought so. Sweet. Can I even complete the mission with some being alive? Oh, oh, he's running into me. <laughs> he ran into place. I don't think I could kill him because he was like part of the mission. Yes. Beautiful. I love pocket money. Yeah. This is Kasilov. Kafilov love. Right. So, I mean, yes, I get to regenerate. But at the same time, maybe only having two. I think three is a bit overkill. So, 550. A bunch of other stuff. I think I'm, I'm pretty sure that these rewards are what I collected in the mission. It's not like on top of. If it was, that'd be brilliant. But I'm pretty sure... That's not how it works. Right. So, that was... Whew, that was stressful. Now, on to the Sukamimus, where we will switch out um, the Sundopterus for a Ankylosaur, that guy. And you know what it is? I will switch out the Draco for the Sukamimus because my tactic is that I run in and then they all come towards me. I send out the Ankylosaur, and the Ankylosaur hits them all if they chase me. But if I send out the Acro, they all get intimidated by the Acro and run away. So this way, maybe it'll work. We don't know. Oh, it's a wild Sukumimus in the area. <laughs> right. Okay. We can do this. I got this. It's just another day on the job. And here it is, the Sukumimus. Already it's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Just got absolutely exploded. Well, that's fine. That's fine. I don't care. We've also got footprints to analyze. So this is the first mission on chapter six, where I'll be... Ooh, this will be interesting. Yeah, look, he bites like three times and ignores shield. So this will be really good, actually. Just to see how well it does. Because I've been like playing with the same dinosaurs. It's, it's, it's always been the Antarctic Pelter, because why wouldn't it be? It's like my only rare dinosaur 
Oh, you're a bugger, you. You're an absolute bugger. Stop it. Stop turning around. Right, let's go down this way. I want to see how much I get for this. Oh, unless it'll be health. Oh, that's good. And it is 70. Oh, very good. Heck yeah. Now, one thing that doesn't change when you do the, um, the Wajima calls it. The Hoosie Me Watsis when you do the medium and hard missions. Uh, th oh, oh my god! And I'm on fire! Jesus! No! I need help, guys! Go get him! Yes! Oh, thank you. Oh, I'll take that. Woo! Woo! Yeah, when you're doing these kinds of missions on medium difficulty, they don't give you any better, uh, like, resources for, you know, looking at footprints and stuff, unfortunately. Yes! Come on, just a couple more shots. There's one more on him. Come on. Yes. Right, I can easy take this guy out. Easy peasy. Well, let's keep on going. Let's keep on summoning dinosaurs to see if I can get some help back. All right. Oh, and from behind, the Sukumimus they were uh, they were after has come back to life. And now I'm about to be shot at by freaking everything. Oh, Lord. <laughs> oh, yes, help, please. Why do you not run at the Antarctic Pelta? Oh, having him and a uh, Critonosaurus, though, that could be pretty deadly. Two Ankylosaurs. That might be really good. We should try that instead of uh, Dracovinator. But I'm assuming they're probably both going to be five. Right, there we go. Here we go. And the lag. And I got hit by the sniper, I think, because that was a whole bunch of damage. Oh! oh, my God. He destroyed a tent with his snipery bullets. Get him. Oh, God. I don't, I don't want to get him. I don't want to get him. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Oh, there's eggs. There's eggs. I saw eggs. Yes. Oh, footprints. Sorry. My bad. All the same, really. Okay, hold on. We have to... Oh, God. The lag. Oh, jeez. The lag. Oh. We're grinding to a halt. Here. Oh, there it is. He's massive. He's way bigger than the Spino was. No. Oh, who messed up that? Oh, God. Jesus. Bugger off. Leave me alone. Why? <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> Antarctic Pelta came in with the clutch there. All right, go on. Somebody poison him. Antarctic Pelta, what are you doing? Just hit him. He's like two, two inches away from you, man. There we go. I need to kill that sniper. Yes. Oh, did the, did the other guy run away? Oh, there. Whoa. Did he go in disguise? He like went underground. Whoa. Oh, don't. Okay. Well, he died out of bounds, but he didn't drop anything. Fingers crossed you wouldn't have dropped anything anyway. And another Sukumimus rescued. Did we get any Sukumimus DNA? Uh, only one. It does feel like if you want DNA, you've got to do medium or hard difficulty. I think that's probably the key. I definitely won't do hard difficulty with three easy dinosaurs. Don't think it's worth it, for gotta be honest. I like these missions better. Like, because you get way better rewards for this. Like, 550. 550. Right, let's have a look. Um, I want to look at handlers because I think I can upgrade them now. Yes, five off. So it takes us to level 16 and I need to be level 20 to get the next one. Okay, so we're a little bit better here. We need to find out Kovlov scientists to do something or other, but really, we don't really care about that. I, uh, something happened. I can't remember what it was. I think we, we managed to capture somebody, but I mean, in the grand scheme of things, we're on chapter six. We've been doing the same kind of missions over and over again. What keeps this game alive, however, is like upgrading your dinosaurs, trying out new combos and different weapons and different uh, mercenaries, basically. Because if the game did not have that, I would have stopped playing this a long time ago. But just seeing all these different like dinosaurs attacks and stuff, it just makes it... Oh, <laughs> he just ac he actually vanished. He was like, I'm going to go into camo and then die. Beautiful. You'll never take me alive, he said. <laughs> I love the about just blowing stuff up in the background, for God's sake. There we go. It's Oh, it's dead now. There it is. Kill the shield. The shield dudes are a pain in the butt. Look, get, get this guy. Dracovinator, over here, mate. What are you doing? I don't care about the sniper guy. Sniper guy's stupid. There you go, he's dead. Now, now, you avoid shield or ignore shield, so go go bite him. Yes, there we go. Yum, 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 yum. He just wants kisses. <laughs> Look, more people. 
Oh, dear. Right, he's dead. Right, okay, go on then. Go on then. Go kill him. There really does seem to be a difference between rare dinosaurs and common dinosaurs, man. Like, a big freaking difference. Right, they're all after me. This is not so good. Not good. Not good. Go on. Go on, Suko. Damn it. Oh, well, at least it did something. At least it, at least it did something. And the Dra Dracovinator always seems to heal me. Oh, 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 oh. We got this. We got this. It's that shield guy. When, when somebody's behind the shield guy, they seem to shoot a lot more. Yes. There we go. Go get him. Get him. Yes. Yes. They don't know which way to turn. <laughs> Ooh, three amber. I'll take it. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. And I'm also... I mean, this game is still an early launch, right? So I'm looking forward to seeing just exactly how different it'll look when it's fully released. Because I remember Jurassic World, the game looked a bit different. And Jurassic World Alive, too. Loads. If you look at Jurassic World Alive when it first launched in comparison to now... It is a completely different beast. I just hope that this one is uh, is supported as much. Because Ludia has the resources. This is created by a company called Behave. Oh, Behave! But I don't know, like, what they've done, really. They do. They have done, like, a Game of Thrones and a Walking Dead game, I think they've done. Which doesn't really bode too well. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. Whoa! One, two, three, four, five, six. How many? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine of them. Run! Oh yes, that's what we want. That's what we want. Get get everybody run into the Antarctic pelt. And four. Oh, yes. In fact, I think the shield dudes protected themselves there. Oh god. Two two sniper shots. Uh, that would be kind of bad. Um, so, yeah, just chomp on them. Ooh, a hundo. Oh, I like that. Yeah, now your turn. Off you go. Go and spit on something. <laughs> yes. Yes. Right, we killed one sniper. There's a, a shield dude over there. This isn't This isn't bad. This isn't bad. Yes. Nope. No, you don't. No, you don't. Right, and talk to Pelta. You go. Oh, God. Just kill him. Oh, oh no. Right, I need health. I need health. I need health. I thought about to just go for it, for God's sake. Stop being a blooming dog and just chasing after me. Go get him. Stop being a good boy. Go kill. I don't have the health. Oh, Jesus. Look at it. It's not doing anything. It's like it, the game just sort of lags and glitches. Right, no, 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 no. No, you don't. No, you don't. No, you don't. Maybe it should have been Sukumimus I should be going for. Maybe that's the case. Yes! Oh, finally! It's dead! Yeah! I tell you what, these armies or the, the friggin' poacher groups go through a crud ton of tech. You think after having like 50 camps destroyed, they might be like, yeah, let's actually. Let's, let's try and just kill these people. Nah. Just keep using the same thing they can keep on hacking and breaking. Right, so that takes us to nine. Now, how much do we got? One, two, three, four, five left. And then we're on chapter seven. Oh, so I've done chapter one on medium. I've done chapter two on medium. Oh, ho, ho, ho. So this will be the last one that we do. So uh, let's do it. Dinosaur traps? They're using traps now? Oh, come on, at least try. <laughs> Wait, they're doing what now? Again? For like the 15th millionth time? <gasps> they use traps! Oh, good lord! I mean, at this point, yeah, it's uh, it's it's a given. It's a given, yeah. There we go. Got that. Right, let's speed run this bad boy. Go on in. Nom on him. Yum, 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 yum. Yes. Oh, don't worry, guys. I saw her. I saw you were like, Beavis, you've forgotten the thing. Oh, no. <laughs> yes. I'll take all of those. We'll have him kill the shield dude, or at least do a lot of damage to the shield dude. And then I will just, you know, not die from that, and then have the shield dude almost die from the Antarctica Pelter. Then have him ki go on, kill him. Yes. Oh, he's, all he's almost dead. He's all One more. There we go. That wasn't so hard now, was it? We just go up and down, up and down. Keep shooting. Oh, hold on. I've got to open me little crate. There we go. Got all of those. And off we go even more. Come on, then. Come. Oh, he's coming from behind. Oh, that was a bad mistake from both of you. You know, a an army of 20 snipers would probably be enough to do me in. But, uh, how I mean, what happens to these tranked people once we, once we do them in, right? Like, like wh 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 what's the next step? I'd love to know. Do we feed them to our, our dinosaurs in the dinosaur preserve? Maybe. <laughs> I guess we'll never know. 
corner. Got you. Right between the eyes. <laughs> da! Oh, you got a little rocket launcher. How cute. You've got a cool little hairstyle as well. Oh, God. Oh, my God. You just committed martyrdom. Oh, dear. There's, there's one of those traps that you've never seen before in your life, apparently. Go on, then. Whoopush and roll out. <laughs> right, Sukumimus, you do cost a lot and you're basically dead. But mm, I don't think I can I can do that until they're all dead, unfortunately. So and I talk to Capelta, man. Come on. I don't know how to choose it to attack something in particular. But uh, let me get me coin. Yes. Attack them from behind. Yes, they're both poisoned. And now it's just up to the shield dude who literally won't do anything unless he's right next to us. Brilliant. Finish it in style. There we go. What, what's he going to say? Traps? So inhumane. Is there anything these brutes won't resort to? You've made this area much safer. Thank you. Well, I can't wait till the next mission and when he uses traps again and goes, You said what? <laughs> 550 extra points. Whew. Whew. I feel like the next video, what we'll do is we'll be in chapter eight. And if unless anything happens in particular, I think we're probably going to end it there because... I mean, unless I unlock a new dinosaur or something crops up, it really feels like it's just the same thing over and over. We upgrade our guy a little bit, a little bit more here and there. We upgrade our dinosaurs to get rank 10. The next big things is basically unlocking new dinosaurs or ranking up a dinosaur because we've never done that before. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, guys, leave a like. Until next time, I'll see you cuties later. Oh, bye-bye.